Hello fellow Evaholics and welcome back. It's Fit Friday episode 3. And look what we got here. We got here a wreath. But what kind of a ship is that? We're gonna check it out because hopefully this is going to make big bucks. Catch you up on the video. Okay, welcome back. So, what are we looking at? Uh, one of my favorite ships, the Wreath. And um, let's see, I have been uh, doing some uh, low sec uh, hauling with Sunasis. And uh, unfortunately, it's very, very annoying to just do it back and forth, back and forth. Because I'm hauling stuff from uh, low sec uh, to the nearest high sec point towards the place where I'm going to be selling that stuff. So, uh, I got bored after three runs, or, uh, or yeah, so I decided to go for a micro warp drive cloaky ship that has more cargo than Sunesis. And what we got here is basically a regional trader, but we have... Um, Medium cargo hull optimization for better cargo without uh, taking out too many of the uh, inertial stabs too. We have two cargo hull uh, expander twos and with that we get a 6k a little bit above. Obviously I think it depends on your uh, skill levels. Uh, so yeah. We have the improved cloaking device and uh, a 5 mn uh, compact micro warp drive so it's a basic meta mo module uh, the best one of them before the t2 version uh, then of course large shield extender and the thermal amplifiers and a kinetic amplifier this gives us a 13 uh, k ehp we have taken out the hardener that's the risk that i'm taking uh, by uh, uh, setting up with this cloaky uh, camper thing. Uh, not the camper, co cloaky hauler thing. So uh, let's get down to business and let's go out and try this place and uh, try the ship and uh, see what it can do. So we set the destination uh, to the place where I have the stuff uh, waiting and we undock and actually we could do a little bit of practice here um, so yeah let's stick around together for a few jumps so uh, I'm going to show you how to do the micro warp drive uh, cloak jump trick I'm actually gonna put that one in there and the idea is that we align then we cloak hit the warp micro warp drive and when the micro warp drive cycle is around like 70% like it starts from here and goes around and that's one cycle but when it when it's around here we take out the uh, cloak and start spamming the uh, jump button so this gives us like uh, one second to get cloaked and then then uh, we uh, hit the warp drive. Nobody is going to be able to uh, lock or, uh, or uh, tackle us then. So let's try it out. So we have the gate there. So we're gonna align immediately, almost immediately hit cloak and micro warp drive. We cloak up. And now we look at the uh, cycle and we are at the 75% and then we start spamming the jump. And like that we pop out of the cloak and we're already in travel. So yeah, that went well. I know uh, I came through this low sec and at Rancer and Miroitem there was... Uh, gate camps so uh, let's see how this goes 
But uh, hey, how about some uh, practice makes perfect stuff? So again, let's do it again. So we have the next gate here ready. And we don't jump. We align. We almost like almost immediately hit the cloak and the warp drive. And when the cycle is at 75%, uh, we start, we take off the cloak and start spamming the jump. Okay, here we go. So align, cloak, micro warp drive. Now we wait for the cycle. It's there, 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 there. And no, and then we spam jump. And when we come out of the cloak, we are already jumping. So this basically should uh, make us uh, impossible to lock on. And well, soon we're gonna be on the low sec part and uh, Let's see how that happens. If you're hearing uh, like weird noises, the dog is playing with with her toy. So again, we do we do have the target there. So we align, cloak, micro warp drive. We wait until about seventy five percent is done, and uncloak and spam jump and we are already warping when we are starting to uncloak it's not that hard the the thing is that you need to have a ship size and a correct uh, correct uh, either afterburner even the smallest ships you can probably fit an afterburner but afterburner is bigger than this the 10 mm and afterburner is bigger than the the 5 mm and micro rope drive so that's why i chose that one we're still cap stable and the only thing we are basically giving up is the the uh, tank here but this trick is our tank no one can lock us there now we're moving like we you can see we have everything in order the speed is big enough and well now i missed the hit okay this is probably stuff that we don't want to see happening in a low sec <laughs> and now we can't uh, put on the micro warp drive anymore so we'll just have to uncloak and jump luckily this ship has a four second line time but yeah like you could see if there would have been gate camp there i would have been dead so now we're gonna <laughs> jump jump into the low sec and fingers crossed we get through this quite many jumps to go but uh, we're just gonna keep a track on the uh, local too it's gonna ask, are you really sure you're gonna go there? You're gonna die. Let's see, do we have a uh, gate camp already waiting for us here? Nope, there's nobody there, but we're gonna still keep practicing. So we align, we we cloak and we jump the micro warp drive. Now it's looking better. Now we don't wanna screw this up. And we uncloak and we hit jump. Now we made it. All right. Now we just don't want to hit any smart bombs. There are three other people on the local chat, so who knows? I think we can like survive one bomb at least with this tank, but uh, I don't know. The next, there's a trap. I think if you start collecting those, somebody's gonna just like jump there and kill you. So we just ignore those. And, uh, Okay, it's looking a lot calmer than it was when I came through. A line. 
Boom, boom. We cloak and then uncloak and hit jump. And boom, like that. We are happily moving onwards through Losek with this many people in local. So, yeah, apparently, well, we haven't. I, I'm kind of hoping we're gonna see a, a gate camp. So, I'm gonna keep recording. I'm gonna leave the uh, link to the e workbench for this uh, fit. And uh, obviously, big thanks to all of you guys. Uh, it's great. Okay. Now, now we don't want to fuck up. Sorry about my bad language. Okay, so we we align, we cloak, we warp drive, boom, and then now, come on, come on, boom, and we jump. No, the thing is that, did they jump into this gate? Nope. I was so, uh, <laughs> I was in such an adrenaline rush that I didn't see. They probably warped out when I cloaked. Are they waiting here? No. Okay, but, uh, wow. Damn. But uh, at least we survived. There's nobody in local, so we can now just jump. And, uh... Guys, there's so much profit in Losek. Uh, you probably don't want to miss out all the opportunities. This is a oh look, there's a criminal now. So uh, uh, there's lots of profit. There's lots of stuff sold cheaper that you can sell into the nearby uh, uh, spots in Highsec or the trade hubs, or you can like haul stuff with a cheap ship like this. This is like 13 million. Uh, so, or at least at the current prices, it was, I think it was 13 million or, or was it something more or 15, can't remember, 13 million. So yeah, uh, so you can use a cheap ship like this to, uh, move that stuff away from Losek to the nearest safe spot and then from there you uh, you take it to the trade hubs yeah this works this is a great fit and now you have seen it working so uh, now I'm just gonna go and drop into the uh, Losek place where I have uh, upcoming uh, where I have bought stuff that I have to haul out of Losek to be sold in Dodixi. So, uh, it's time to make bank. We survived the scary Losek uh, corner cutting. Uh, so, now we're just gonna dock here. And I'm gonna thank you, all of the new subscribers, all of the comments I've been getting. It's very encouraging. Love you guys from Jita to Amar and back. And uh, go out there, uh, try Losek, uh, try this fit. As you can see, it works pretty charmingly. And uh, uh, the cloak jump trick is not too hard, really. You just have to practice it in high sec to master it, and then you can easily go to Losek. And just hope, have fingers crossed, you don't come across smart bombs. But uh, yeah. Until the next video, uh, which is going to be the uh, week 4 report on this challenge. So, um, until then, uh, big thanks, fly safe, make isk, enjoy eve, and uh, see you.